If it's not bulging at the top like that, I don't want it. You guys already know I love repurposing my leftovers into gourmet meals. Today we have this shredded drumstick that's been sitting in my fridge for probably like three days now. Let's make jalapeno poppers. First thing we're doing is putting our leftover chicken into this bowl. For extra volume, this canned chicken from Kirkland. Some mayo for flavor. Two heaping spoonfuls much left of cream cheese. So we're gonna use this. Crystal hot sauce, as much or as little as you want. A little bit of garlic salt, black pepper, green onion, and cheese. A little bit of lemon juice too. I only have bottled, so we're gonna do this. Tiny pinch of fish sauce, that's it. This is gonna be that umaminess in the background. When your guests take a bite of it, they're gonna be like, what is that? What is that beautiful flavor in the background? And you're gonna be like, secret ingredient. Mix well. I got three giant jalapeno. Cut the top off, slice right down the middle. Hollow them out, just like this. Generous scoop of our chicken mix. No one likes a skimpy buffalo chicken popper, okay? Sharp cheddar is not gonna give me that super cheesy cheese pull that I'm looking for, but it is gonna give me some contrast to the color on the chicken. We're gonna do some cheddar cheese. Give it a little bit of a dusting on top. Because of physics, I'm gonna give them like little blankets instead, so that way I don't have to flip the jalapeno popper. Boom, blanket. And you guessed it, we are air frying. While the poppers are air frying, I thought I'd show you what I do with my leftovers. Um, obviously, if I had more jalapenos, I would fill them up, but I don't. I like to use these ramekins and kind of fill them in there. And boom, I got buffalo chicken dip. Take a parchment paper or saran wrap and like push down. Don't forget to date and label your freezer safe Ziploc baggie. And then I'll freeze them just like this. When I'm ready to eat, the night before, I will remove it and place it into the refrigerator to defrost overnight. And then top with cheese and air fry. Enjoy with chips, carrots, celery, anything. Into the freezer. May have overstuffed them a little, but are you even gonna be that mad? Some ranch right here that I'm gonna use. Cheers. The buffalo chicken filling is legit life. Like who's gonna know? I used leftover chicken and canned chicken for this. 